So here I already created some blocks. Now I will take the data of these blocks as an inner table form. We will go to insert and we have option here extract data. So after clicking, it will ask you to save the file. If you're not saved, I'll click save. We'll define the location. I will save in the documents and we'll specify the name data extraction. And save. Now we'll click here, create a new data extraction. If you have any previous template, you can use the previous template of DXE or BLK formats. If you have any existing data extraction, you want to edit that, you can also edit the data extraction. Now I'll choose create a new data extraction. Say next. Now it will ask you to save the file type in DXE format, the data extraction part. You can give the name again, data extraction DXE file. Save. Now we'll click on next option. So it will show you all the information of that block it will happen. It will show you block and non blocks. So I have three blocks file and other non blocks file. So we can untick the non block files from here. Now next, we'll click on the next option. Now here again we having so many informations are available here. So what we want to display, we can keep that only. So I want to display only attributes that I have given in the blocks. So we'll hide other things. And keep only attribute to be checked. Say so next. Now here we'll get the count option, name, cost, ID, and size. So if you want to rearrange this also, we can rearrange these things here. Like I want to keep it cost here, ID here. Well, ship them according to our requirements so after arranging everything you can click on next option now this file you want to take into the drawing or as an output file so i'll take into drawing and say next you can define a title blocks detail next and finish so we'll get a block details here so like this we can produce a table without doing any hard work. So that's how we can extract the data.